Hello everyone and welcome back. With paintbrush tool, we decided to design a white swan and create something like a logo. At first we should find an image of a swan and put it in Illustrator and start drawing with paintbrush tool. Let's hop into the Illustrator. If you are interested in this video, please subscribe to my channel for reaching to the previous lectures and click on the bell button so whenever I publish a new video, you are the first one who can watch it. Ok, I prepared a picture of the white swan here and locked it to my artboard and you can do it by yourself, you can download a picture of a white swan for creating this logo and designing a white swan. So at the first step, I should select the brush tool here, I select the paintbrush and if I double click on it, I have the setting here. This is fidelity. If I reduce the amount of fidelity, for example something near the accurate and press OK, I create a brush, something like that and again I choose a smooth and press OK and create a shape. This is smoother than this one, this is more accurate. Ok, I press Ctrl Z. And now I prefer to put the fidelity in a smooth mode. Ok, now I press OK and go to my swan picture. Let's design it. Ok. At first we design the neck and the face of the swan, very easy with the brush tool. Now I want to design the wings. Ok, now the upper wing. Ok, that's it. Now select the selection tool and from the object here, I press unlock all and delete my image. This is my swan which I designed it with brush tool. Select it and put it here. And now I want to zoom in. And with the diary selection tool, I adjust all the points and I want to move them on a one point. You should be very patient in designing with the brush tool. Okay, and the last one, I put it just on the path. Okay, that's it, this is my swan, I want to move this wing, you 
select these parts and put it here and again with the direct selection tool I customize it and now it's okay. That's it. Okay, now I zoom in in the face. I want to create a line between this anchor and this one. Again, with the brush tool, I create a line. And with the direct selection tool, I select it it here and select this one and put it here and with customizing the handles I can adjust it to my favorite place here you go okay now I want to add the background to my picture I select the rectangle tool from here I create a background and change the color to something like that I press the right key in the arrange and I want to send it to back. And go to the object and lock it. Okay, now I select my swan. And now I want to add a white color to it. But I have a problem here. You can see some artifacts in my shape. So I press Ctrl Z. Again select it and use the shape builder tool. I select all the parts I want. Okay. That's it. It's good. And now I select all of them and I'll add white color. And select these parts. Okay, now I want to add a gray color to the face of my swan. Here I add it, and now I select this shape and this one, remove the stroke, and zoom in. Select this one and this one, and again remove the stroke. Now I zoom out and select this shape and increase the size of the stroke. 5 is ok. Put it up. And put it down. Ok, that's it. You can change the color by your opinion, but I prefer to add white color to my swan. That's it. And that is my simple white swan.